We have cheating in college football. Watch what happens right here. The QB, Bo Nix, he fumbles the ball. He fumbles the ball and then spikes it backwards. That is a fumble. Watch. He fumbles the ball, but spikes it backwards. That should be Arkansas's ball, guys. It should be Arkansas's ball. What happened? Arkansas would lose on that field goal attempt. They would lose. But look at the play, guys. It was cheating. What did they say? The SEC came out and made a statement. And he said there was no clear recovery, guys. They said it was a fumble, but there was no clear recovery. They called it intentional grounding on the field. And they said no one recovered it. No one recovered it. But watch what happens here. They said there was no immediate recovery. Let's look at Arkansas. Looks like they recovered it. Looks like they recovered it. That is a bad call, and that is cheating. And they should go back and give the game to Arkansas. That is cheating. Clear recovery. Freeze called it intentional grounding. The wrong call. That is cheating. Then they could replay it. They could go and replay it and review it. But what happens? They call it intentional grounding. Auburn makes the field goal. Auburn wins. It's cheating. It's cheating. They said in the SEC that it was a fumble, and then in replay review, there was no immediate recovery from Arkansas. That is the wrong call. Watch what happens. Was there an immediate recovery? Let's look at the play again. It's a fumble. They admit this is a fumble. And what happens? Arkansas jumps on it. They get the ball right there. The referee made a mistake. The replay didn't review it correctly. This is a travesty. This is corruption. This is rigged. This is cheating. Clear recovery from Arkansas. They were screwed.